This is an advertisement for Monster Legend Game! <laughs> oh, oh, this party, I'm dancing with some monsters! Yo, you was ugly. Don't be don't dance close to me like that. It's FGTV! What is up, FGTVers? It is Duddy, and I'm here with this game called Monster Legends. It is amazing! Do not cheat! I don't cheat. What's it? What? Fair play and force? What do we do? Okay, um, so I've been playing the game for a while, and now it's time that I show you just how powerful my monsters are! So if you guys want to download uh, Monster Legends, they actually gave me this link that I put in the description where you can download it and get a free gift that you can use in the game just by clicking on my link, bro. Okay? Hurry, this offer expires exactly 24 hours from when this video was uploaded. It's available on iOS, Android, all that good stuff. We're gonna talk about a bunch of cool things. One of the things, there's this thing called Monster Dungeon, and I'm so close to unlocking this awesome monster called the Duchess. Now, here's the problem. You should be on level 85 to knock out these opponents. I'm only on level 50. So we, for the first time, are going to equip some runes. Monster runes are basically these magical little gem things that increase your abilities. So we're talking more strength, more life, more speed, more stamina, crazy. So I'm gonna take my top three guys here and I am going to get them beast because I'm only on level 50 up against level 85 duchesses and I don't stand a chance. I've lost many times. This time I'm gonna see if the runes can help me unlock a duchess egg which then we can hatch. All right, we are heading into the monster dungeon with Will Razorface, Varuna, and Akena Top. They're all on level 50. Look at these dudes are on 85. Blitzer chart. What? Dude knocked off like half of my life. Oh my goodness. I'm almost dead. See, this is an unfair battle. 2800, 2800. I look for my highest attacks. I have so many different attacks. 3145. Yeah, let's do that one. Evil Rising, watch this. Look, I just come out of the ground and breathe on him with my hot breath and it barely got him. What? So you just kind of got to cycle through your attacks, see which ones are stronger because they're all different. This one's my highest, 4,014. Piracy is the way of life. Oh, yeah, look at my guys. That was sick. All my, my little goons coming out of the ground, beating them up. Uh, each one of your attacks is different. Uh, based on your enemies because like if I'm water in legendary I'm not gonna be strong against another water character but these guys are earth uh, I don't know oh my godness they legit killed me already now it's because these guys have 35 more levels above me good thing with three gems I can continue the fight right here Stoning, oh my goodness, this guy's almost dead again. What, he is dead? You gotta be kidding me. All right, how about uh, the power of ancient dark sand? Oh yeah, oh yeah, I like that one. Let's finish off this guy, yeah. The dead. And then it's cool because some of your attacks will like leave everlasting um, damage to them. Or that like that might hurt them each turn or make them lose their turn. But uh, you just have to find the right attack. That's a pretty good one. It takes away 2,000 life. Yeah, that guy's got so much health. And I don't. All right, I had, to, I had to fast forward because I died. I died so much. But this guy's, we almost have him down. Looking for my highest attack. This should be it. Yeah, look, he, he lost the turn. All right, turns like he's down to 50. We down to zero. We did it. We did it. Sick. All right. He's done. Victory. It's in the house. Oh, and this is cool because after every victory, you can spin this in the chance to win more runes, food, gold. In this case, I got I got a thousand food. But uh, monster cells. There's just there's so much about this game. It's crazy. Look, my reward, the Duchess, complete. Have completed it. Enter. Sick. We did it. So right now, it actually goes to my stores. Look, these are my guys that I have, and there's the Duchess. So the Duchess, I put him in my hatchery, and then he'll hatch. But right now, I'm gonna speed this up for 37 gems, and I'm gonna get my monster right now, place him on my magic habitat, and look, there's his egg, his second form, his third form, and his vital form. And watch this. Yo! 
He sends missiles. That's so sick. The Duddy Evolution. Yeah, all right. Oh, why do I look the same? Third time's a charm. What is happening here? <laughs> Stop laughing at me because I don't evolve correctly. <laughs> And now I have a number 44 in my Monstagram, the Duchess. There's over like 300 monsters in this game, and some of them are just amazing. I want toys of these guys. All right, and now it's time that we get this guy leveled up. There's this stuff called food. You might have heard of it, and I can feed him. See, feed him, feed him, feed him, feed him, feed him. Boom, next evolution at level 20. And uh, you learn new skills when you get to like level seven, level, I don't know, is it, 10, and then I think 20, you keep learning new skills and you can um, get more and more powerful. And then here's what my guy looks like. I just keep feeding him as a second evolution. And now look, so now I have an extra skill here. I have to delete one of my other ones. Now Blitzer Charge, not as powerful as my Rock Shower. So boom, now I got this guy. This guy is on level 15. When I get him to level 20, he'll look like the big guy that you saw before. I want to show you this other daily challenge where I got this character here called Mudflow. It's basically a Halloween maze and I've already claimed him. I have to move my characters down the line to unlock monsters. It was pretty sick. So let's actually use this guy, put him in our hatchery so we can hatch Mudflow. The hatchery is cool because it's how you hatch new monsters. So there's a whole bunch of ways that you can collect monsters in this game. You can buy them, you can win them, you can hatch them with eggs, and there's all different ways to get eggs. There's also this thing called a breeding mountain where you can choose two different monsters, breed them together, and then get a whole new monster. So earlier I breeded a Varuna, an Akenatop monster, and the result, it gave me a Shanky monster. I don't know, I don't have this guy, so we're gonna check him out. Put him in the hatchery. So it says seven hours left, so I'm actually gonna come back in a little bit and show you what Shanky looks like. I got some whack monster names. So if you guys wanna give me some suggestions of uh, changing some names of these monsters, maybe if y'all have some good suggestions, I'll do it. I did it. I don't even care, I'll do it. <laughs> Fast forwarded a lot a bit. Check this out. Here's Shanky right here. He's about to get his next evolution. Watch this, and boom! Got a new skill, I have to replace one. See, this one has a 30 charge, 13, ooh, yeah, wow. Let's totally replace Razor Claws. Yeah! That's what he looks like now. That's cool. Ooh, is that a bird? I love birds, hey! I hate birds, get out of here. Shanky be killing birds up in her! Here's a little look at, at, my, at my islands here, okay? I have this island, which is basically, look at this. I'm just collecting my food. Boom, 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 boom. See all this? I'm just collecting my foods over here. And uh, I, I pretty much, I choose the 75,000 one because uh, it's ready in one hour, gives you 3,000 food. I just hit repeat all. Charges me and then boom. We get right at it, that's how I have so much food. And then good thing about all my monies is uh, your monsters, when you have them in your habitats, like this is my water habitat, I keep getting money. So like look at all this money. This is how I get money in the game. Whenever your habitats have monsters in them, you gain money. And each monster will tell you how much money they gain for you. Like this one is 53 per minute for the greenest. Uh, but uh, these legendary monsters and legendary habitats are sick. Because they give you so much money. Like look, one monster, 45,000. Boom, 36,000. And if you look at this guy, 244 gold per minute. My boy, Akenatop right here. Uh, he gives me 244 as well, level 50. And so like my legendary habitat's on level one, if I were to upgrade it, it would cost 10 million to upgrade legendary. But then I could have two monsters in it, and instead of 400,000 max gold, I get 600,000. So upgrading is all a part of this game. Uh, but anyways, this right here, this is Monster Lab. Uh, I haven't even really messed with Monster Lab too much. This right here, this is the Halloween maze we were talking about earlier. This, this little island here is pretty much reserved for my temples. Uh, temples, and I also have some over here. The temples are great because they allow your monsters to get on higher levels. So that's how some of my monsters are on level 50, and uh, some not so much like this guy. Let's get him on level 50 and see what he looks like. And come on, Acto Crush. What? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Oh! Check him out. That is sick. I wish he had punching gloves on every hand. Maybe he does for his next one. Here we got the breeding temple. I actually have to, re I have to repair it. What? 
So this will actually make my breedings go faster. 4.8 million, I'm gonna go broke. I'm not gonna do that right now. Over here we have some more legendary habitats. These are some of my cool guys here. I like this app because you can zoom in and see the quality, the detail on these awesome looking monsters. Oh, don't move my, and it's so easy to like redesign your, uh, your islands and move things around and make more spaces. So right here is mud flow that we got in the Halloween maze. Let's finish instantly for 12 gems and check him out. We have to place him, but oh no, my earth and water monster habitats are completely filled. I could upgrade it to level four, which will allow me to have one extra monster in it for 3,600 monies, but it's gonna take seven hours. That's all right, I'm gonna finish instantly for eight gems and we did it, we did it. So now it's time to go here and hatch mud flow. Let's place him. I sound like the guy from, you know. So here he is, boom, and boom, and boom. Sweet, I like how they, oh, what's he do, what's he do? What, what's up, homie? How you doing? What's he do? What happened? Oh, he's sending down water. Dangerous water. He's number 312. Look, I have 66 monsters. Like my block heart, this guy is amazing. This thing is sick. Watch this, watch the scary bucket. It's a. It's a, it's a brick, mo look at this, shoots a gun, got a bucket, Legos come out to break them. Oh my goodness, that's amazing, isn't that? That's, that guy is so cool. I don't know what I did with him, he's not anywhere. But anyway, here we go, um, Mud Flow. See, you could rename these guys. You guys gotta give me some suggestions of what I, what I should name these guys, because these are just the stock names here. But anyway, watch this, next evolution at level four. Boom, look at him now. Looks like a wise frogfish grandpa eel snake. And it's, let's do it. next evolution at 15. Got a new skill at level seven. And then watch this. Another new skill at level 10. Yes. Level 15, what you looking like, buddy? Oh no, I have to replace a skill. How about that one? Yeah. And there he is, my buddy. He's like, ta-da, I'm here. He's so cool. Check this out here. Multiplayer, dungeons, adventure map. If we go to adventure map, you see, th this, is, this is where I've gotten. I'd have to fight these guys right now, but they're on level 60, I'm on level 50, I've got my runes. I've actually held off, because I'm gonna wait till I upgrade all my temples, so that way I could be on level 60 to fight these doof nuggets. So I'm not gonna do the adventure map right now. You already know about the dungeons. The other cool thing about this game is the multiplayer. That's right. I have 1,208 trophies. I can change my team with with any one of my monsters that I'd like to fight with. But these are these are my top these are my top three guys right here. Oh, I don't have any runes on this guy. Uh, let's not use that guy. Let's use this guy. And I can actually search for an enemy. So you actually you actually play against real people here, but just for security and privacy purposes, I have uh, blanked out these people. But see, he's on level 70. I'm on 50. I'm like. Forget this, man. I don't think I'm gonna win. If I do win, look right here. I could steal 225,000 of his gold and then take 7,000 of his food. It's so mean, but it's so awesome. And if I win, I get 15 trophies and, he, and then I lose 15 if I lose. But uh, if you don't like your matchups, like if I'm like, yo, there's no way I'm gonna be able to fight these guys, then I can press search enemy. Let's find somebody else here. Level, this is even worse. I can't beat that dude. That rose monster is pretty sick. Look at these guys. I'm level, I, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna spend so much money searching for guys that I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna win here. Ooh, 45, 42, and 50. I can take these guys. This is no problem. So watch this. So now I'm gonna fight. These, those monsters are sick. I wish I could just like press a button to unlock all the monsters. So right now it's my turn. Here we go again. This time let's get a little bit more in depth. Power of the Ancient Dark Sand. You want to use your attacks on the, the best attack. So I just go through, I look for strong people. Look at that one. That one's 3,145. Let's smack them with it. And feel my hot breath again. Yes. And I took away 14 of his energy. You see the bar underneath your red bar? That is your, uh, your energy bar. And if you don't have energy, you can't attack. So sometimes you have to re-up your energy. Right now I have full energy. It'll actually tell you, like right here, it'll tell you like it's gonna steal light from target, requires a cooldown, which means it can't use it for a little bit. It's gonna do that to my bar. See, 115 energy left out of 140, but it's gonna do 4,000 strong damages to this guy. So we're doing it. Chop him, chop him, chop him. 
this guy, I, this guy, he can't win. Now, when you start off, your attacks won't be this strong. They'll be like, you know, 200, 400. But if you play for as long as I've been playing, oh, he's Sandman, sick. That dude is made of sand and he attacks from the ground, man. Ooh, he just attacked all of us. Oh, look at that guy's tail. Did you see his tail? It just hissed at us. Did you hiss at me, fool? Now, if you actually like click on your guy, you actually see like what kind of attack he has. You can learn all about him. So if you want, you can click on the other teams and you can see like, you know, what they're immune to or whatever. That way you can really get strategic. But y'all know my name, it's Doofy Duddy, and strategy is 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 not the strongest part. You know what I'm saying? But if you look at here, uh, it'll see the effect. Uh, he'll leak stamina for three turns, but then energy regeneration also happens for three turns. This one will actually leave him possessed for one turn and slow for two turns. So it may not be like, even if it's not your strongest attack, in this case it is, but it's not always, you have to think like, well, dude, I need this guy damaged for like the next few turns. So what, I'm gonna do it to this guy, the rise of the mummy, and feel my breath. Speed, look at that. He's got negative speed, negative power. You really have to study these attacks. You don't wanna look just at the numbers. You wanna look at what they could do. Like this guy can daze for three turns. So you wouldn't wanna use it on someone that's about to die. You'd wanna use it on this guy. Cause we wanna, oh snap, I got all of them. That was, I killed two birds with one stone even though they weren't birds and that wasn't a stone. Sick. So, oh my goodness, that was amazing. So we got a tsunami here. Let's actually, let, let's see if we can blast him. Yeah, oh, he, he, fr he had a turn lost and we froze him, but then he died, so it didn't even matter. Victory, so look, I stole the resources. I got 140,000 of that purse's gold in your face, whoever you was. And now I get to spin the roulette again. I'm hoping I win a maze coin right there. That was a bad, it says nice spin, but that was a bad spin. Ooh, what's that? I got three Thundenic cells. That's if you use the monster lab. You can like craft like your own kind of monster using the best abilities from what you like about certain monsters. This game gets so in depth, it's nuts, dog. This game also has something called loyalty rewards. If I play the game for a certain amount of days, I could win a cool monster. And I'm going for the Helberis next. This is crazy, this is crazy. I know it's a lot in one bit. I know it's a lot, I know it's a lot. But we are now going to check out the Halloween maze because I've been going for so long. All right, and this time I'd like to unlock Frankenstein. This is Frankie right here, baby. You see right here, he's at the top. So if I press move, it's gonna cost me 30, but boom, I move, I got a treat as my reward. You could use those treats in battle. Oh, I shouldn't have showed y'all that. There's so much in this game. You could use those treats for health, extra attack, just like the runes, there's like more power-ups. This game's insane. I can move again for 30, and then now I'm here. Oh, I gained myself a spin. Hopefully I get me a gem. And no. Yes, I got 25 maze coins. That's perfect because, oh, look, now it's 35 to move. But that's all good because I just got 25. So it really only cost me 10. And now I got 2,000 gold. I am the man. Oh, my goodness, it's beautiful. Move again. So now I'm here. Spin. What do me get to me? Will? This girl's cute. Thanks, hot stuff. You're welcome. Ooh, I got a script monster sale. So now I gotta move again. Basically, oh, see a fight node. The Halloween monsters will not leave the darkness of this maze. Fight to force them out. So I'd actually have to fight right now. Well, let's just see what the monster is. It's Tyranna Kings, Giga Gas, Scubbas. These dudes ain't worth my time, man. I'm just gonna, this time I'm gonna skip it. Usually I do it, but th this is not worth my time. I would ham it in. I would ham it in. Let's see. Boom. 1,000 boots, thanks again. I just have to get my guy all the way down here until you see those little checkered areas, like you see that right there? That's where I have to get him to move him. So right now, my next move, he will get a key. With that key, find the remaining key to unlock the cage monster. Oh, what do I have? I think I have two keys now. You can unlock monsters when you get to them. Let's move it again, 35, boom, I'm gonna spin. This is so sick. This game, you guys have been asking me to play this game and other games like this, and I've been sleeping for so long. And I would always ask Mike, like, 
Why do you like Dragon City so much? He loves Dragon City. I'm like, why? I don't get it. It looks like so boring. But no, it's not. I totally get it now. It just keeps you busy for so long. And these daily challenges are amazing because they're so much fun. And they just allow you to play and 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 get addicted and spend all your money on the app store. And then your family walks out on you because they're like, we never see you anymore because all you care about is your monsters. Sorry, I'm projecting. All right, and uh, next move, boom. Looks like I just got 10 Bondolfio cells. Thank you, sir. Next move, I get myself a gem. Collect it. So you see, I've been, I've, been, I've been saving up for this video. That's why I have so many. I didn't buy these. I actually been, you, you get these daily type of uh, things. Uh, it changes all the time. In this case, it's this maze coin. They're, they don't always look like that. You get them by, by battling, you get them by feeding, you get them by collecting gold, you get them by breeding, you get them by hatching, and that's how I have over, you know, 1,200. So look, they go up with each move though. Now I'm at 45, I hope I can, I think I can get to the end. Move again, 50, boom! I actually just spent 50 and I got 50 maze coins. Are you guys following me here? This is amazing, but watch this. It starts to get a little foggy. Oh, I just unlocked Gretchen. Whoa, she cost a hundred. Ah! Stop it, mom! Come here! You just scared me! You look like a crazy monster! Stop I'm playing a monster game! Get out of here! You look like a crazy mo look at this monster! Honey, I got him! Ah! All the times you scared me! That's my mom! She was creeping behind the TV over here like a crazy! I, I, I was looking at the camera, this is what I see. So I'm talking to you guys. Ah! Stop! Isn't that freaky? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Anyways, that's my mom. She actually has her own YouTube channel because that's how awesome she is and it's called Funky Bunch. So go check out youtube.com slash funky bunch. Now get out of here. I'm doing a video right now. Okay? Holla at your boy, mom. Continue, I unlocked a new monster named Gretchy. And, oh, and I found 3,000 foodies. Yes, makes me want to shake my booties. Oh, oh, dance party. I'm dancing with some monsters. Ew, you is ugly. Don't be don't dance close to me like that. You're crazy. I'll punch I'll punch you. Alright, so let's continue to move through the fog. What's that? Oh, monster cell. Oh, ooh, Captain Legends. That's great. So I'm continuing on my color paths here, and I'm almost there. I got a gem. Now watch this. One more and boom! I now just unlock Frank S time. I can hatch him. And now he's being hatched right now. And if I wanted to, I could speed him up, but I'm gonna be patient, because now you guys got the idea. Anyways, guys, that was it. That was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. I enjoyed. I was like, Bruh. this was amazing. This was, uh, I hope you guys were also like, Bruh. and um, and not like, ah! when you saw my mom's crazy, creepy, creepy mask there. But um, yes, that is it. Thank you so much. We appreciate you watching. Let's collect some gold right here. Let's collect some gold. <laughs> what do we got here? 29,000. 8,000, 1,000, 2,000, 1,000. Look at this, she's so cute. I love you guys. I hope you love this game. Link's in the description. Download it. Get yourself a free gift. That's it. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Stop it.